For the neck decoration template, we're just going to focus on one area. So these three joints here go straight down kind of the head to the neck. And you can see as I rotate, they rotate with me, but they keep this bow tie in the right spot. So the way this is working is we grab the face here, and then we pull out the rotation of it. And in this case, they're unpacking it, multiplying it by a negative 0.35, smoothing it by 80, and then packing it together. And we can show this a little bit more simpler if we just take this multiply node, grab the rotation, and put it directly into these three joints. So we miss out on the exponential smoothing, but it's easier to see what's going on. So this 3D head rotation is just being multiplied by negative 0.35 and then added to these three joints. So as I move, the joints rotate. And to better illustrate this, let's just multiply by one. And obviously it's not looking good. I'm gonna hide all these occluders just so those aren't in the way. Okay, so now you can see as I rotate my head, these joints are going in the opposite direction as my head is. And if I change it to a negative one, it's kind of working, but it's going way too far. So that's where that 0.35 value comes from. And depending on how many joints you have and how big they are, this value is going to be different for you. But yeah, that's essentially how this works. And in this case, they're using some scripts to pull out this information. But if you take this bow tie and drop it into this last joint, it should functionally work the same. It just doesn't have any smoothing applied. One last cool thing about this scene is this bust occluder here. If we make this visible, and it's not lined up here, I think because we're in this 2D view, but you can see as I move my head around, this bust stays in the right place, but the neck and the kind of head area move along with me. And that's because this is weight painted to those joints. And so this is how you can make full 3D busts if you have like a 3D head and a 3D body. So using this kind of joint system, you can rig a body to follow the rotation and the position of a head.